Hello everybody and welcome back to another video uh, from Coffee from by Gordon. So today I'm going to be making Cobra coffee. Now some people have uh, actually messaged me and asked me um, what Cobra coffee is. Is it the same as iced coffee? Um, Cobra and iced coffee are two totally different things. Uh, iced coffee is quite simply um, an espresso shot taken from your coffee machine and poured over ice. Cold brew is um, coarsely ground fresh coffee beans um, brewed in fresh cold water and that's what we're going to do. I'm going to show you the process and talk you through the process of making cold brew. Cold brew isn't something you can make instantly, you have to prepare it before and it takes a good 24 hours to prepare uh, a nice fresh tasting cold brew coffee. Brewing freshly, brewing freshly grounded coffee beans um, uh, with cold water takes out a lot of the acidity and a lot of that taste, that acid taste that coffee provides. But it actually makes it taste a little bit sweeter. So it's more like a, a nice refreshing drink, especially if you have it with something. So today I'm going to make it with orange juice and I can honestly assure you it's a fantastic taste and it's one of my favourites. So, to make cold brew coffee, what do we need? Well, first of all, we need freshly ground coffee beans, ground to uh, the coarsest possible um, grind you can get. So this is taken from my machine and it's coarse ground. Some fresh water straight out the tap, a strainer and a couple of jars to store your coffee in. Now, the ratio of making uh, cold brew coffee is for every one scoop of coffee beans, you need eight um, parts water. So for every one part coffee, it's eight parts water to make your brew. So I've already got this measured out, yeah? And what I'm simply gonna do is just pour the coffee in um, to the cold water, like so. Pour it all in. And I'm going to give it a stir and just mix it through. Just keep stirring it up into the cold water. Make sure you get it all soaked in. Normally what I would do is pour the coffee, the, the water on top of the coffee beans. But for the simplicity of making the video and just showing you the amount of water that you need and talking you through the process. What I've done here is just done it the opposite way, but it makes no difference. So, once you've stirred your coffee through, like so, put it into a jar. Now I'm using a couple of little mason jars here, so ones with a lid. And you're simply just pouring it into the mason jar, like so. Fill it up. Pop on the lid. And you stick that in your fridge to brew for a good 24 hours. Okay, so um, what I've done is I've got one prepared earlier. So if we pop in one second. And here we have, this is one that's been in the fridge for 24 hours. There we are, cold brew. You got a nice um, crema on the top from the beans and it's been cold in the fridge brewing for 24 hours. What to do now is get yourself either a muslin cloth or a strainer and we simply pour that slowly into the strainer. Making a mess at the same time, enough. 
as I always do. And just like that, filter through. I'll clean up my mess here while that is filtering through. And because it's a coarse coffee you're using, it does take its time to go through the sieve. And just let that dip filter through. Now you may need to do this once or twice with the Cobra coffee. Just to get rid of any excess beans. So while that's doing that, I've got one prepared. So here we have some freshly filtered cold brew coffee and some prepared orange juice. So I'm going to this away. Now this is cold brew that I've filtered through twice, through a sieve, into a pouring jug. It's freshly brewed. Um, Freshly brewed 24 hours ago and freshly filtered and what I'm using is I'm using um, diluted orange juice. I find the taste a lot fresher um, and not as acidic as it would be using fresh orange juice. It's your preference. You can use with apple juice if you want. You can have it with cranberry juice. Um, you can have it with lemon and lime juice but I prefer the orange juice. And you can see I've taken a, an average size tumbler glass and all I'm going to do is add in the equal to a shot. So just simply pour in your coffee slowly. Right to the top. And there you have cold brew coffee with orange. And it is a fantastic taste, nice and refreshing. Delicious. Thanks for watching. If you want any more hints and tips on making coffee, give me a, a message on the Facebook page. Until then, thanks for watching the video and we'll see you again soon. Cheers.